Hello YouTuber, welcome or welcome back to Pierre Cook's at Home channel. Today for your own pleasure, we are going to make together the crab rolls following four simple steps. Step number one will be to make the bun. You will need to combine plain flour with yeast, with salt and sugar with a mixer. On a side, in a pot, you're just going to heat up butter, water and milk. That's it. The secret here is to leave the mixer do all the work. That's it, let it mix. Once it's mixing together, you're just going to mix for eight minutes and let it rest for an hour until it double size. Look at this. This is impressive. Wow. That's it. You've done a brioche dough. This is a massive step for this recipe. Once it's done, you're just going to portion it at 125 grams, stretch the corner, place them in the center, roll the dough a bit, flatten the dough, and then your first bun will be ready. This is a massive step for this recipe. You're doing so well. Just keep doing. The mix of one egg and a tablespoon of milk will give you this beautiful, shiny, colorful, dark brown, golden crust on the brioche. You can just glaze it twice. Do it. Really well recommended. Before you stick everything in the oven for 20-25 minutes. That's it. The buns are done. Step number two of this incredible recipe the dressing. You just have to combine all those ingredients together and mix them. That's it. As simple as this. Don't forget the herbs, don't forget the chive, and you can season to taste is important. That's it. Dressing is done. I think this step number three is going to be the easiest step of the entire recipe. You just take some crab meat, you crumble it, you add the dressing, and it's done. You've done three steps. Now the last one, the final one. Cut along the edges, add a bit of butter, pan fry those buns nicely. And then you're just going to cut in the middle, almost all the way through. Add a bit of shredded lettuce. And then you're going to spoonful the crab mix. Be generous. Don't be shy with quantities. This is very important. That's it. You can really congratulate yourself. You can just keep looking at them, but I wouldn't recommend to wait too long before you eat them. Your job is done. To top it up, you can do a bit of sweet potato pampa if you want to, or eat them on their own. Thank you so much for watching. See you soon. Bye.